Hello everybody, this is Alex from SoyaChinchow.com and today we're going to try out a brand new feature for Touch and Go RFID. So before this, RFID is normally used for paying tolls and Touch and Go is exploring more features such as paying for petrol and even for parking that's coming very soon. Touch and Go and Shell has teamed up to offer RFID fueling. So basically you can pay for petrol using the RFID tag and they're running a one-month pilot at five selected Shell stations in the Klang Valley. This includes Banda Sri Manjalara, Taman Tun, MKVE, Taman Konot, as well as Bin Hotel. Once you enable RFID fueling, you don't need to mess with the card terminal at the pump. Just drive in, pump, and drive away. It's that seamless. I signed up as a pilot tester about a month ago, and I've really activated it as soon as it's open. And it's pretty straightforward. You just need to launch the Touch & Go e-wallet app, tap on the shell icon, and then you enable um, RFID refueling. You just need to select your preset amount so it can be 10 20 30 50 or 100 ringgit or 200 ringgit and don't worry if you pump less because they will actually refund the differences back to your e-wallet balance and of course you can also enter the bonus link card number into the app so that you can earn points while you pay for petrol once that's done just drive into any rfid enabled bay and start refueling and since this is a pilot only selected bays have the rfid feature to refuel with rfid just drive into the bay Park it nicely and then look up at the LED screen on top. Next to the screen, you also find an RFID reader. So that actually scans the tag that's attached to your car. Once you see the green nozzle icon on the LED screen, that means you're ready to pump and you're given only 80 seconds to pick up the nozzle from the pump. Once you're done, just put the nozzle back and that's it. Your amount will be deducted from your e-wallet directly. Overall, I think it's a pretty seamless experience. You just need to drive in, get out, refuel and drive out. You don't need to mess with your phone apps or you don't need to touch the card terminal at the station. So this is a completely contactless experience. And that also means that you don't need a phone with you, which means that if you set this up for your family car, anyone that drives a car can also enjoy RFID fueling. So it's pretty seamless and yeah, it's great for the family. Well, if you compare this with Settle by Petronas, the difference is that Settle requires an app. So if you want to pump petrol using Settle, you need to drive to the Petronas station, uh, launch the app, select the pump number and the desired amount and that's how you refill so you need to have a phone with you each time you use it but the benefit of settles that is more widely accessible it's available i think in almost all petronas station nationwide if not mistaken and it's available at all uh, bays so any let's say the station has 10 bays i think all 10 will be able to use settle since this uh, RFID refueling is still like a beta program, well, there are some limitations. For starters, there's only a selected number of bays that support RFID. So that means if there's another car that's parked at the bay, you gotta wait for them to leave before you can use RFID fueling. At the moment, it isn't clear when uh, Shell and Touch and Go will expand this to more stations. And if they do, will they support all bays at the station? So that's still up in the air right now. So that's a quick experience with uh, Touch and Go's RFID fueling experience with Shell. Um, is fast, seamless and convenient and hopefully they can roll this out to more stations. Uh, that's all for now. Uh, this is Alex from SoyaChinchow.com. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up, like us on Facebook and don't forget to subscribe to us on our YouTube channel and hit the notification bell icon so that you'll be informed of our future videos. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Bye!